so hey everyone welcome back to code arena and today we are going to be making this hazelnut ui design home page in figma so yeah let's get started so the steps are first of all to start open figma and then click on the blue button which is the design file right when you click on design file you'll be having this kind of dashboard right and then you have to click on frames this is the frames button and then click on desktop you will be having this kind of desktop right and also when it comes to desktop you have to set width of the desktop as 1440 which is already set and you have to set the height as 962 let me set the height as 962 right after that you have to go with layout grid option go with the columns and then click on count which is 12 and then go with 100% white color click on center set the width as 75 and the gutter should be 15 so for now we cannot see the layout grid color because it's totally white let's go with totally black or red you know anything okay so now let me give the title hazelnut homepage right and the background color is this okay so we are gonna go with this background color just paste in the fill option and the background color is set so now you can see this is so dark the layout grid it's not visible so let's go with white right and then we can give the name also we can write here hazelnut homepage so now let's start making this all you know filling all these elements here so firstly we have this logo right you can build this logo or you can generate this logo from anywhere like bing image creator or canva it's super easy so just put your logo over here right here and now we are going to be making the nav bar just create a text here and write here home right go with this font which is outfit i'm going with outfit font with uh, let's say semi bold or we could go with bold also it's your choice let me go with semi bold and uh, set the font size to 27 or if you see so big of it you can go with 24 or 25 it's upon you right so this is the first part let me put this home here and then we'll duplicate this by clicking alt for four times here and then you can give the other names like about us or you can go with uh, services and the last one should be let's say contact us right so as you can see these all things are not visible properly so we're gonna set them so let me go with this and let me keep this here keep this contact us page here so the nav bar is completely done now let's move further now let's create the heading just duplicate this by clicking alt and write your text of the hero title so we are going to write here discover essence of hazelnuts right so it's completely done now you have to select the font which is outfit only right and uh, okay let me write here outfit and then select the font size to let's say 87 and then go with bold option right it's completely done just go with this kind of space here so our hero title is completely done now let's create the hero subtitle to create it just duplicate this and enter your text so here is our text which we have to put in the subtitle of course we are not going to be keeping this much of font size so just simply go with 20 pixels of font size and uh, keep it regular you have to select this font right so we are completely done with the hero title and the hero subtitle right you can edit it from your side right now let's go with the image basically i found this image from google you can do the same right just go with this image and put it here and now let's create the buttons so create a rectangle here go with 260 pixels of width and go with 84 pixels of height go with 50 pixels of corner radius and go with this kind of color code right just put your button here I think you should decrease it a little bit and then check your width and height and then duplicate this button remove the fill option add the strokes and go with this same kind of color or you can go with totally white with one or two strokes and then just go with this keep it like brown and just keep the text at the top and then you can write here by hazelnuts keep it here 
I think you should decrease some font size, keep it to 20. You can add some letter spacing also if you want. Okay, now it is completely done. Duplicate this and you can go with totally white and you can write here view more. Keep it here and then just hide the layout grid for a while. Okay, so it looks magical. I just love this. And now the thing is we have these kind of little circles. Let me show you how to make these. Right. So firstly, what you have to do is you just have to go with this shapes option and then go with this circle. Make make a circle. Fill this circle with this color code. Okay, you can actually see which is this color code and put it here and go with this effects option select layer blur and go with 480 pixels of layer blur right so you could see now this is so clear or you can just go with 300 pixels of layer blur so it's more visible right you can decrease and increase it's upon you you can duplicate this also but uh, if you don't want to we have one more color code just go with this go with this and select this color code right so it will look more creative so we are completely done with our hazelnut home page the figma file is in the description thank you so much everyone for watching